Hi there, it's Hillary and welcome back for another Creative Faith video. Today I am setting up a planner for my mom. She wanted a planner for Christmas and I made this one especially for her. <laughs> she just wanted the monthly layouts. She did not want any weekly layouts and so I made this planner for her. And I will link it down below on Amazon. It comes undated and it comes bound. So I took mine to Office Depot. I had them put a spiral on it as well as a plastic covering on the front and back because that's what she wanted. <laughs> and it has this really pretty blue, it's my mom's favorite color. So I made this really pretty blue alcohol ink cover design and it says best year ever. And so I already, last night, went through and dated the whole thing. And I added the months here, and I added all the months to the habit trackers. So, and then I also added a few holidays, like Father's Day, Mother's Day, Memorial Day, um, Easter, stuff like that. So, <clears throat> I have it kind of prepped and ready. What I thought I would do, I'm going to add a sticker, one of my 2022 vinyl stickers here, and I'll link those in the description box below if you want to pick one of those up. I have a handful left, and then I think I'm going to kind of lightly decorate the pages, and then I thought I would also um, make use one of these Avery tabs so that she can have the current month marked. And these are from the Planner Society. And so, and then these are Avery removable tabs. So they're really awesome because you can move them around. So I think I'll put that for January. And then I found this cute little blue clip in my stash. So I thought that kind of would look cute to have her monthly calendar all marked, but if she wants to take it off, she can. That's kind of cute peeking at the top. So yeah, I'm probably going to put you guys on fast forward now and just, and it'll probably take me maybe even a few days to do this. <laughs> I'm not totally sure. I don't want to go like, to you know, totally out because I don't think my mom wants it heavily decorated, but I think she would like it sort of decorated. So I'll probably just put some washi tape and maybe some printables or something like that. And then I'll come back at the end and do a full foot through of kind of what I did. And I will also link in the description box below a blog post I have that is my planner products and printables. Um, so it has everything I have ever made related to planners. So definitely check that out if you love planning. So let's get this baby set up.
here we go with the final flip through of the planner for my mom. It did get a little chunkier as I worked, but that's okay. It, it's not a very large spiral, but I don't think my mom will be adding much more to it besides using a pen. So yeah, you guys got to see me set up some of it. I put one of my vinyl stickers here, which I think looks really neat. <clears throat> and then this is from my summer mugs printable. It says seasons change, but God never ever changes. And a lot of the pages at the front I didn't really do much with. So she can kind of set them up how she wants. The birthday page, I just added our immediate family and she can go in and add her siblings and stuff like that if she wants. And then I have this really cute washi tape. It says so much happy. And then at the top, it's like this kind of pretty stars. So I thought that looked birthday -y. And now we have January. This is my new um, New Year's journaling printable and it has these really pretty blue mugs and it has lots of phrases for the new year. It has journaling props as well and I will link this new printable in the description box below. It's a really great one to pick up as you are setting up your planners for the new year. Then I put this one here. This is from that same new printable. It says new year, new prayers, new adventures, new dreams, new chances. And I added a really pretty gold washi tape. A lot. I used a lot of washi tape in this setup. <laughs> and I think this is my favorite mug from the new set. I love how that looks. The little bow. And the bow and the Avery tab match the blue plane. And then you have the January habit trackers and gratitude. Again, so for each month I use the same either sticker book or the same printable, same washi tape. So each month is cohesive. And for February, I used two printables. I used my Extravagant Love Hearts printable and my Valentine Mugs printable with this very pretty purple washi tape. February is my birthday, so I marked that. And then I added the some of the holidays in here too. And I think this looks really pretty with the mugs up and down the pages with the pretty heart washi tape. And I will link those two printables down below as well as my green mugs printable for March. And I use this really fun star washi tape. March is St. Patrick's Day. I used the shamrock mug. And this is actually um, the anniversary of my parents' first date. So it's kind of a special day. And you have the habit trackers and gratitude and reflection. And now we're to April. I used my Easter icons printable. No bunny loves you like Jesus. <laughs> Cute bunnies and carrots and I did lots of Easter eggs for the monthly setup for April. And new hope, new life, new creation. Habit trackers and gratitude. And the beautiful cross matches this pretty washi tape I have. That's purple too. And then for May, I used a Happy Planner sticker book. I used um, this one and a handful of the setups. It's the big flower power one. I love flowers, so I've used our quite a bit of this sticker book, but there's still a lot, of, a lot left, but I love this sticker book so much. So I use these fun ones for May, Mother's Day, just something bright. You know, there's that saying, April showers bring May flowers. <laughs> 
In June, I used my butterfly printable, which I'll link in the description box below. It says Jesus is with me during seasons of change. And I added this kind of little sketch butterfly trail. And I think that looks really pretty. And the printable comes with some washi strips that I put along the bottom. And yeah. For July, I used my summer mugs printable, which I'll link down below. And this really pretty light blue washi tape. That matches well. I love how that turned out with the mug with the stars on it. So I basically kind of decorated each page the same <laughs> with some washi tape and stickers or printables, but I really like how it turned out. Um, for August, I used a sticker book I picked up from Hobby Lobby. I was trying to kind of mix it up so each month would look different. These cute little cats. <laughs> Thought this was appropriate for the habit trackers. Yes, you can. I'm gonna use these little arrows so she can write kind of bullets for August and then made kind of like a little banner at the top. For September, I just used the sunflower washi tape. But I think it looks really, really pretty. Because, like I said, the book was starting to get thick, so I didn't want to add too, too much. October is my mom's birthday month. I use that same Flower Power sticker book with these kind of fall colored flowers. And I put my birthday because that's my mom's birthday. <laughs> And I use this really pretty. Most of the washi tape I used in here is from Simply Gilded. Almost all of it, I think, actually. Some flowers and the bows and the blue. Habit trackers and gratitude. I love the little floral clusters. In November, I did the same where I just used this really pretty fall floral washi tape that's also from Simply Gilded. I think it looks really pretty. And then for December, I used my new Christmas Cookies 2 printable. And I'll link that in the description box below. It's a really, really, really fun one. I've been enjoying using it this December. December is a very full month. It's my husband's birthday, my dad's birthday, and Christmas and New Year's. And we have our habit trackers and gratitude and reflection. And then I didn't do anything with these pages at the back, so my mom could do kind of whatever she wants with it. So that is the planner I set up for my mom. I hope she likes it. <laughs> a lot of blood, sweat, and tears went into this, but I think it turned out really, really pretty. And yeah, it's neat. I've never kind of set, you know, sat down and planned and decorated a whole year at once before. So anyways, be sure to pick up the monthly layout calendar planner on Amazon. It will be linked in the description box below. And comment below, what do you think? Do you think this is a good gift idea? Did you like how I decorated? I'd love to hear. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss out on any Creative Faith videos. And I will see you next time. Bye! I can't believe it. I just keep bouncing it off the back. <laughs> Alright, this is from... Somebody. Best year ever. Oh, my calendar. And you already fixed it up? I decorated it all for oh, you. That's nice. But minimal decoration. Slim nice. Jeans, Thank I you. Hope I'm slim enough for the You like it? Yes, Is for sure. Your Levi's, Dad? Yeah, they're a different type, though. See my month at a time? <laughs> I got lots of dates to put in here.
Thank you.